Hello, all my dear friends. Let me to show you this mind talk from Lei Su. It is a uh, 1 to 16 uh, scale. And uh, R100E, here is the decals. And uh, some unused spare parts, wires, screws, holes. So that's what left after assembly and also the manual for assembly. We assemble this from kit. So have light and sound. We will start. Okay, first is the light. Switch on. Also, the cabin inside have light. Off, on, switch, and cabin inside light also on. Okay, so sound, make horn, start the engine. So the steering, it is for controlled by hydraulic. So now, only after start the hydraulic pump can start steering. So the pump now it is at 60% uh, load. It's going. Slowly. Okay, go back. So from the back side, I will turn around, go back again. You will see the light for backward warning light and go forward, break in light, backward light. Okay, let's go forward again. I will lift up. So one small issue it is because this one have two multiple level cylinder for lifting up the bucket. So when you see at the beginning it's a little bit shaking because they got resistance from the cylinder, yeah? So this one if without loading, without heavy cargo, it will be a little bit shaking. Also when going down same. Going down, a little bit stuck, yeah, because resist resistance from the cylinder. But check if you have some weight on it, like you pull cargo, will be more smooth. Yeah, and also if you have cargo when you're rising, also will be less shaking. Yeah. Okay, let's have a look. So I will turn around the wheel, you can see under there. So from this angle here, you will see the suspension. For this one, I actually got the cylinder for suspension. You see how it's moving inside, actually inside the cylinder, it is spring. Also, same for this side. I will press a little bit, you can see. Yeah. That's the front suspension. So front axle is no power. It's uh, only for steering and uh, controlled by hydraulic cylinder. I will turn around later to show you the downside. From this angle, let's see what is the heart of this driver motor. So with this protection steel net, inside is the brushed motor, very big one with the speed reduced gearbox, then transfer the power to the shaft. Okay, so have a look from this angle, you will see the rear shaft, shaft axle have this uh, connecting load for shaking and the suspension we will see from the rear side. So when I shake it, you see how the suspension work how the axle can roll in. Okay, turn it around. So, I, yeah, I have to lower it so we can see the rear side suspension. And then you can look at the very strong rear axle. So this have two cylinder acting as suspension. Here is the connecting rod. 
Yeah, so this one very strong one. So because the cargo, you mostly put mud and rocks. Uh, we can lift up the axle for you to see how it's rolling if we're driving on the big rocks. So for this axle, have speed reducing gears and at the rim side, so the speed reduced and uh, can run it slowly. So this one got no transmission gearbox, so only one speed, but got the differential lock. Let's check it out. That is very heavy. Now it is at the differential. I will lock it. Going. Okay, now it is locked. Okay, let's check the speed unlock. Because you may hear the gears sound because this one's actually you see very big. So many big gears inside the the sound will be bigger than normal the truck because this is a big one. Let's have a look at the downside for the steering. So now it's turning left, turning right. So for hydraulic, it is very strong. So no matter where you're driving, it have enough power to turn it. Check how strong these connections for the shaft. Turning on that side. Okay. So here it is the and the driving engine part, you press here, then unlock, you can turn it open. Put the, this is the 3S battery and the receiver. Actually, you can push more, the receiver can put down there. So I just leave it here so you can see inside. So here it is the uh, distribution valve and one more valve. It is under there. So here is the oil tank. This one is the filter. Uh, down there it is the pressure release valve so right side we got this toolbox it is not oil tank yeah only decoration so put some tools there okay so from here let's open this right side door so you can see inside and i will turn around so you can see this side is the door so this door also can open This box here, from left side, also can open. Yeah, so we can put some tools there. Okay, so I will put down the hydraulic and put the bucket down. Backward, driving. Backward. Okay, put on the bucket. Close the door. So if you have cargo, a little pressing, it will be less stuck. Make our horn, we will finish with this one. Engines. So that's all the details and the running of it. And uh, for this one, we still have in stock. So if you like, we will get it assembled and even can paint in different color as you like. So come to me, the best price will be offered to you. Thank you, see you.